Hey YouTube, I've had my Pylon Tech batteries for about maybe two, just over two and a half years or under three years. And um, in November last year, I inspected them and I noticed that they were swelling. So upon further inspection, uh, you'll see the photos here right now. I noticed that both batteries that I had actually swelled. Now, remember, I, I may have mentioned this in my in one of my previous videos that I didn't go heavy on batteries because they're quite expensive and it uh, results in a, a longer payback period. So I started off with two batteries and they were adequate for my needs. They they uh, usually uh, powered the um, house, the supply, all my my fulfill my demand for about uh, maybe until about half past eight at night every day and i was uh, um, de I, I was degenerating them until about uh, 30 percent uh, state of charge on a daily basis this was now before load shedding so i didn't have any high uh, demands at night uh, most of the heavy loads were already fulfilled during the day like uh, dishwashing and and so on so anyway um, i now replaced those uh, two pylon techs with a uh, sa lithium battery which is a 5.1 kilowatt hour battery and i had to update the firmware and so far so good however what i have noticed is that the I had to use a default setting upgrade the, the firmware on the on the inverter and use a default setting to the, the, the default 100 amp hour lithium battery setting but what I noticed is that the, the inverter charges it at about 60 amps initially and um, whereas the battery recommends up to 50 amps so that's I'm having a conversation about that with Goodwee because the inverter should should only charge according to what the BMS uh, limit is. So that's a different conversation. But nonetheless, I must say I'm disappointed with the pylon techs because they are three years, just under three years, and they pop. So yeah, really disappointed about that. But let me know your experience with the pylon techs. Have you had it longer? And how have they been? Because mine's reached about 91% uh, state of health. And um, that's that's when I started noticing the swelling, and fortunately it didn't explode. Hey, okay? we were lucky for that, right? Yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, and please share your thoughts here on your on your experience with Pylon Text.